Hey guys, it's Mr. Fuzzy Lego here, and welcome to my first installment of my massive project to complete every Super Smash Bros. Ultimate Fighter before the game releases. And today, I bring you number 13, Princess Peach, and her Echo Fighter, Daisy. And I'm super excited to finally show you these guys, because I've been vacation a super long time. And well, I'm gonna, I finally finished them today, and ready to do a video on them and start this project. So, without further ado, I'm gonna go ahead and show you these figures. And this would have been a more professional video, but of course, uh, I don't really have the resources to do that right now, so instead, we're gonna move these guys out of the way and I'll show you them individually, one by one, without the camera stopping, because who cares, really? I mean, you're still gonna watch this video anyway, right? All right, let me get this camera for possession. Possession is a bad thing, don't do that. And we're gonna go ahead and I'm gonna put Peach's arm back on and I'll show you her first. So, Princess Peach. Believe it or not, this camera is actually really good and it took a really long time to actually get this to work and I'm really excited, so without further ado, he's Peach. So, it's the same model as the first one with the, with the uh, not the first one, but it's the same design from, I don't even know what I'm saying anymore, look, the, the, the figures, the pieces are the same from my last Peach, but the design of the Super Smash Bros. dress is carried over from the 2014 one that Deku Scrubs made, which no longer exists, but it's engraved in my memory because it's such a cool design, so the credit is by him, and I'm going to stop talking now. Whew. Okay. So, yeah, the design for this dress is, comes from Deku Scrubster from a long time ago. It's a really cool design, and I've always carried it on for Super Smash Bros. Peach. You could tell me that it's good to do different designs, but honestly, it doesn't. it's not broke, why would you fix it? So, as everyone else says, so yeah. Uh, it goes three-dimensionally all the way around, and that's, it's pretty cool. The hair is the same, but I colored it in a different color. This is like a yellow with a brown mix, so it's not just a straight yellow. And her face, blue not, was really difficult to paint in there, because first I had to scratch off the original eyes with the hair still on without breaking it and I had to paint the lips and the eyes with it you know still being on that was really difficult to do but I got it done it looks really cool and she has a three-dimensional little jewel on her chest and it's that's pretty much it her arms can still move and are fully articulated again and that's that's it's really it for Peach I mean it's pretty simple so yeah and next is Daisy who is a lot more fun to make because it's probably just because she's a newcomer or it's just Daisy, but she has the same design basically as Peach because she's an Echo Fighter. And it's, it's pretty much the same design, it's just a few other details. For instance, her shoulder things are not as big as uh, Peach's because I, I think I was looking at pictures and they were a little bit smaller. And she does have a, the, uh, the sanded in torso, so she looks more feminine because it looks a lot better than just using a straight torso. And yeah, she has the same design but just Daisy-esque stuff with like the two lines in orange down there. And it's, yeah, it's very simplistic. The hair actually looks like it's breaking off, so that kind of sucks, but what can you do? And her arms are uh, this time tan with the blue, with the thing. I don't know if I do that. And she has a chest, a three dimensional chest. That sounds awful, but a three dimensional jewel in her chest. That's what I was trying to say, just like Peach. And it's a bit smaller. Technically, that should be a flower, but I can't do that in right Lego right now. I don't have the resources, so it's just a circle with blue in it. And her face is fully painted based on her uh, official artwork for the game. And I think it turned out pretty well. It looks just like Daisy, so I'm happy. Even the eyebrows up there, which are painted up there, you can't remove the hair, so that kind of stinks, but it's fine. And she has earrings, and just like Peach, and yeah, she, you know, there's the hair breaking, so. You see my fingernail, look how dirty it is, because I've been painting all day. But yeah, that's, that's pretty much it for Daisy, and I'm super happy with the outcome of these figures, so. Let me know if you've enjoyed this, and her hair just fell off, there it is down there. But let me know if you've enjoyed this video, because I'm going to do a lot more of this style, because I have to complete all of the characters in Super Smash Bros. And that's, that's pretty much it, so I'll see you guys next time. Let me know if you've enjoyed this video, and I dropped that with a like, and maybe even a comment down below. That would be awesome to hear some feedback, and I'll see you guys next time. So, goodbye, and have fun with stuff.